What's up guys, this is The Rofman, and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as France. So to pick up where we left off, uh, Great Britain declared war on me, um, unfortunately dragging me into a war in North America, which I didn't really want to get bogged down in. Um, but the upshot of this is that my forces, which were in America, I didn't manage to extricate themselves, extricate them from the continent in time, so this is going to go badly for the British. So firstly, I'm going to... Uh, withstand this attack from the British in Pennsylvania, then I'm going to capture it, then this force up here in the north will be isolated and crushed. So let's crack on. Uh, water's run out, which they probably will. I'll try... Then again, so I don't know if it's true. Off the top of my head, I can't remember if it's true. If I sort of counter-assault now, whether or not that works. I think it's one of those things in my head, I remember it vaguely working. Um, a few times since it's never quite not quite really worked okay so well this is an excellent field of fire very very excellent so let's set up my royal french troops on the flanks that's not a great position we'll actually draw them back a bit so they at least get some there you go their fields of fire only start to Kick in once they're over the hump of this ridge. Excellent. And let's deploy my, my artillery in a similar position. Let's deploy these infantry on the right. Uh, deploy one set of howitzers in each position. On each flank, sorry, to provide support. Sorry, I've got a pack of BBs in the way of my artillery, <laughs> artillery shots down here. Let's put some corridor boy on the Flanks again, not really. Well, no, I say not really sure what they're going to do. I'll put a unit of grenadiers on each flank um, in response or waiting for their uh, cavalry. And similarly, with my cavalry, I might actually put them a bit wide. So I've been always been putting them about here, but they always seem to arrive to the battle a bit late. Then my general can go here, who looks awful familiar. Okay, so the majority on the right, so I might shoot my grenadiers into the line. So my artillery's opening fire, the cavalry's moving up. Who are we trying to hit? Good, we are trying to hit their forces in the field. That's what I've got. Some colonial lines, some native musketmen. Some Farlock armed citizenry. There we go. These are the lads you want to watch out for. So let's take one of my my closest. Well, maybe not even my closest. Just get one unit of howitzers to hit that marine unit. Let's take another one to hit. So that's grenadiers. Well, hit the grenadiers then. Why? Give me an artillery to hit the Colonial Light. See, this will get a bit dodgy, actually, when it comes to canister shot. However, we are not firing canister shot yet. Knocked out a few. So I think I'm going to move my unit of ground is here into the line. Did I turn their other one's firewall on? No, I did not. That could have almost... Bit me in the backside. Okay, so they're doing that. Are the howitzers leaving their equipment? They are. Good. So that means I will take this ridge with my troops, support them with grenadiers and rangers, and move up this unit of cavalry. There you go. Let's give these guys bit more support and let's straighten my line out a bit more. Let's uh, divvy out my artillery a bit better. Good, that other marine unit. So we've got the 9th foot guards and the 8th foot guards. But there we go. Ok, 
to get my gun switching to cast shot. Start raking these infantry. Howitzers are in, f firing on. Devastating volley. Skirt my rangers around. Are there artillerymen? Their, their garrisons are still getting involved. These guys are not. Well, this unit is just, but still bring them around to get them involved. And then let's hit this. Get this grenade unit in position. Yeah, so I want to try to run my rangers out of the way. So a few of mine are going to be killed by my guys charging in. But that's almost the cost of doing business. And then run these guys this way. Halt fire. I'm completely okay with them routing. They've absolutely smashed. Let's turn fireball off. Spin my grenadiers around. So the gunners are going to charge my my gunners. They're reorienting their fire for some god awful reason. Oh, I had another unit of light horse. At least so I can kill their garrison mortars. Good. My gunners are still manning their guns critically. So if my my so hopefully these guys get some shots off on the tribal auxiliary. On ultimately, I'd like these guys to run in. To be honest, I don't really don't be afraid of file like arm citizenry. My other cavalrymen back. Hit the seasonary unit. You clean up this unit of Rogers Rangers. Set my, set my skirmishes to keep hitting them. Don't worry about them. Oh good, so once they smash through this unit of Rogers Rangers, they'll probably kill most of them. Finish off this unit of... Okay, so all of my marines are here getting involved. Uh, so, losing track of my cavalry. There they are. So then let's... Oh, my artillery hit that last unit of marines. Now you keep chasing down that unit of foot guard. Where's my general? Let's get him involved. There's only one unit of marines left and they're not going to last. Let's halt their fire wells. Let's keep my artillery firing on their artillery for now. They've got to find something to aim at. Some of their cavalry has returned. Okay, Union of Marines is come back, so let's Let's halt my artillery fire, because they've also now... Okay, so you kill that marine. Then you hit that unit of, cam of that artillery. You hit that colonial line. You are clearing up that unit of grenadiers. There's nothing there that I really want you to kill, so run back. Chase after that unit of marines. Okay, so all of the marine units are over here. 
So let's take this unit of cavalry, run them over here preemptively. My general's bodyguard, you can chase down this unit of colonial line. And this unit run in provisionally to hit this unit of marines. And then let's move up these guys to also provide fire to hopefully make them break. Or do I just smash into them now before this last volley goes in? Then let's halt my howitzers. Too late. Because I'm, yeah, I'm fine with them routing because they're rubbish units. But these are where my. where the marines are. And when the marines go, I must kill. Yeah, get my general to try to chase them down too. Ooh, these guys won't actually get their unit. Good. So go on to that unit. So there's a unit of Rogers Rangers going to get away, but that's fine. Come on, one last guy. This last Marine. Chop him down. Got him. So all of my cavalry are hunting down this last unit of marines. We are finishing them off. Pecking away at them. <laughs> Get him! <laughs> Chop. Give that man a hundred gold francs. Neutered. Utterly. I'm probably right for the attack. Um, although it is the British turn, so there's no... Yeah, 200 men remaining. Yeah, so they have laid siege to my territory. Um, <coughs> which I'm okay with. Well, I think I might be. I'm pretty sure I must have a... Counter offer. Just do that. No, fair enough. I don't want to give you my... My... My, uh, my land... Not for nobody. Oh yes, I've still got the crafty Württembergs to, for, to fight. Um, but they are on to the last region, so they should be a swift conquer. I've got the Spanish are still harrying down in um, Guyana. They're also interfering with the Austrians. Good boys. I also need to do some military spending on my navy. And then hopefully fight some carefully orchestrated victories um, in order to... Uh, no. Although to be honest I could do with peace with the Ottomans. Mainly because it would give me effort. It means I could focus on the British, who, now that they've declared war on me, I feel justified in now just purging them. Oh man, they're attacking me again. Let's fight. And it, you can see how frustrating it is, the Baps, but they've lost even more on the units they have are junk. But the game is still shrugging its shoulders and going, it could be 50-50. But you know, it's a brilliant game, other than, you know, sieges and the AI and decision making. <laughs> Apart from all of that stuff, then, you know, it's great. You know, when the Ottomans decide to crash your game, and I love it, I can't remember where I to attack you on the campaign map. The Ottomans attack your PC. That's how they win. Um, I definitely want to hold back, hold up on this bluff, I think. Uh, yeah, you're not going to blow each other up there. Because, yeah, well, my units aren't completely dead... They are a bit vulnerable. Um, probably going to get spikes, actually. Because it'll probably be the more useful thing. I'm not worried about getting shot to bits. I'm more worried about getting um, charged to bits. So, it's pretty unique of militia up there to do something. 
uh, put a union of hessians in here to fill this gap. Do that. What the hell that was? Is it a firework? Could be. Uh, pikes. Oh god, I got so much artillery I forgot about too. Um, so let's take this artillery, deploy them here. They're going to be a bit strung out. Let's put a a unit here to tr so it can support everyone. So which means my cavalry is going to come out here. This infantry is going to go here. My pike's going to go here as well to protect my artillery. Where did that militia unit go? So this area is going to be pretty, pretty exposed. Oh, did I steal one of the wrong artillery? No, I didn't. I've just got loads of artillery. Holy moly. Good. Let's get my general towards the main battle line. Good. They've all deployed on the left. Of course they have. Very well. Let's abandon my defensive plan. And they're on the move. So... Cavalry is not in a bad position at all. Keep pummeling. So they deployed it. I'm too honest. I'm impressed. I'm impressed the AI has done quite an aggressive thing. Okay, these guys fire onto those camels. Divert some of this artillery fire into the camels. <laughs> They're already routing. Zimindari horsemen are probably going to route too. <laughs> Is the eye retreating? Trip is the camel nomads going to be careful of because they're actually dangerous. Form square if you can. It looks like the AI's messed up. Realise they can't actually beat me, so they want to create a faux siege, which I'm more than welcome to do because it means they've left their mortars completely exposed. So let's get this battery, you all. Knock a hole in that wall. To be honest, these guys may as well just charge in. Let's move up this Union of Hessian line. There's my pikes. They've taken an absolute hammering from those mortars. Oh no, they've changed their mind. Move up aggressively, they don't know what the hell they're doing. See, it would have been sweet if I could have got a uh, delicious looking salt there, but you know, you play with the hand you dealt. The hand I've been dealt is. Even though they may be weak, they are still good line infantry unit, so get them up on the walls. 
They're not ready to repel me yet. Okay, halt, 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 come back. Because that's the general right there. Let's get these guys in a position to fire on the artillery. Keep this guy chasing down their mortars just in case. Because they're not taking positions on the walls or out or anything. Or just let them let, let me kill their general, I suppose. Because what have they got? Bowmen, some mercenaries, some musketeers, some bowmen, just lots of bows. So let's sit. To be honest, let's just halt. Let's just take the walls if that's what they want to do. I can see what they're doing out of this doorway. with their game is that I can just man the guns inside the walls. Now the gate is mine. Ooh, good job I remembered. Good job I totally didn't forget to turn the... Uh... There we go. So now the gates are mine. So they should shut. And this unit's going to man the walls very, very quickly. Open gates. Oh wow, they're going to try to run in that direction. There we go. Just run straight into them, I suppose. I think that is fireworks. Let's see if my guys can get one more volley off. It's a very close, intimate battle. If they stopped to shoot, they could really cut my guys down, but fortunately they won't. So have my guys made it through yet? No, there's one guy. He is determined to fight them. To be honest, I may as well charge into the side of that bowman. Get these guys just to run here and do something. I'd like these guys to man positions around the walls and shoot, but I think they're 
They're a bit unhappy. Oh yeah, because one of them is still on the wall there, trying to fight them off. So just run down and kill them there. There you go, they've been attacked in all flanks. And it's going terribly. Now here, though, could be an interesting one. Oh my guy made it. If he stopped floating down there and actually got back up on the walls where he's supposed to be. These guys. Turn firewall off because that's just asking for trouble. Or just charge into them as well. Yeah, just charge into them. It might be worth garrisoning this fort with another, um, with another, well, with a semi-competent garrison, actually, rather than trying to, you know, scrimp on it. If the Moogles are going to make this much of an effort onto it, then I might have to just fight and keep hold of it. There you go. Heroic victory, because they... Persuades in a very aggressive position, particularly with its mortars. I've never seen the game do that before. And then just absolutely stacking it. Oh yeah, so... Dutch Guyana's going to be mine again. No! Don't say you... You... Wow. I just got utterly played by the AI. You know what? In a weird way, I'm proud. <laughs> At least it means that that army will... Uh, I'll pull that army out, and then I will deploy them somewhere else, There's and it just means Genoa's going down. Developed. But holy moly, that's like the smartest move I've ever seen that I actually play in this game. That was really well done. Good Prussia and Austria... Oh, I was about to say good Prussia and Austria at war. BFD. Okay, so let's try peace and trade. Excellent. Ah, oh, Sweden, you're very friendly, eh? Austria, let's trade. Five grand? Yeah, that'll probably be worth it in the end. Prussia, we don't like each other, but we can make money. Oh, fair enough. Guess not. Württemberg, very friendly. Peace and trade with the Prussians. Persians. Eight grand. Here, have the socket bay in it. No. But at least it does mean that my border here is a bit more secure. Okay, so let's go. So smart, smart decisions. Smart decisions. Need to make smart decisions. Um, Paris... Poor iron workshops, but iron masters works is always a good idea. Paris is still happy. Calais is going to be delivered, which is going to be another commercial base, and I'm probably going to want to build a Admiral's flagship first rate, which will suck up all my money, but at least it will give me a first rate ship of the line to go with these ships. In terms of money, 20,000, it's not as much as I'd like. Hold on. Mughal Empire has Comey. How quaint. But yes, I need to get a navy down here. <laughs> to pull my armies out of the Genoan territory. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn, damn, damn. 
It is, bo it is a bonfire night, so that's why. But I suppose this army is going to go attack Nassau. You know, if Britain wants to... Okay, well, first going to pit stop in the uh, Leeward Islands. So, Pennsylvania, Philadelphia. Maintain siege for now. Where is that other British stack that's coming in to reinforce it? I don't know where that's coming from. But Boston is doing very well. New Haven's about to be developed. Good. More economic buildings. Cameron Pine is trying to attack. Oh, yes. Please, please attack me. I've got boatloads of infantry and you've got no artillery. So how many turns can I like? One turn. So I need to fight them. Or I need to... Furious storms in New England continue for over a week. It's not no more than an hour or two. Wow. That's not great. Come on. Oh, it's pressing control. Sally out to fight Cameron Payne. But, looking at the timer, I think we've reached the end of this part. So, thanks for watching, guys, and hopefully you'll join me the next time for the Sally out of Albany. See you guys.